Alright, so we're getting into match one. Let's have a good game. Oh wait, or not. Ready? Start out. Okay, so <clears throat> you struck to final. I'm not actually too knowledgeable to match up. I heard I want to say something like if like the Peach plays it right, that like what's it called? Paco shouldn't really be winning or anything like that. And also, okay, I think he knows the Shang up. Okay, he fucked it up. Or he might just after he probably fucked it up. But so yeah, I heard Armada say something like, you know, this is really, really, really good for Peach, and I kind of agree. Uh, it's called Falco, can't really, like, just trap down Peach. Also this shit. Actually, no one can really, Falco can't really, like, trap down anyone, which is kind of weird. Unless he's, like, right on top of him, but, like, you definitely don't want to be right on top of Peach. So it's kind of like, you kind of want to, like, camp him, but kind of don't. Um, but at the same time, I don't know. It's just kind of weird things that I've like heard, but they're always like kind of distorted from what the actual person probably actually said. Um, what I've kind of seen is Peach kind of dicks Falco off the grab, which just kind of sucks. Kind of stupid actually, but it's like whatever. Reese has this one thing, I won't call it a gimmick because it's definitely like a viable strategy, where he'll very much like set up his opponent to like shield and then like down smash, like directly onto shield. He'll usually always down smash after he hits a shield, which isn't necessarily something you can avoid, if, especially in like that situation where he kind of got stuck in shield. Normally, when people are losing to Reese, they kind of like what's it called? They end up like shielding in places where they could probably just like roll out or just get out of the way. In that sense, rolling is kind of okay against specifically Reese, not against like Peach, but against like Reese in general. Although that's pretty good. I don't know why he decided to stop, but it kind of worked out in his favor. See. You know that Sandman's kind of getting like really really close to Reese when he should probably be like taking a small like I don't know he, he tends to get close and then Reese will be able to attack so he's staying too close in situations where he doesn't have an advantage that sucks for Sand and he kind of fucked up could have done a little bit more there maybe Dare in order to do that especially because he has to turn up like Dare into Nair afterwards that should be a kill but he went for Dare there I don't know if I agree with that but at the same time, I'm not a bitch man. That was a stitch that's hilarious. So, he has two stitches. That's, that was funny as hell. I'm gonna laugh my ass off if he gets one more. Not too bad. He's spending his time floating, like, really high in the air. Something good about it is that, like, he can't really get attacked by lasers, but at the same time, he kinda, like, well, you can kinda see where it's coming from very easily. So, I have to say, for, from the Falcus perspective, I kind of maybe want to like just get under it, maybe up tilt to cover. Well, up tilt doesn't really cover a lot, but it's like, if you get he's like really really high up in the air, you have a lot of time to like get under him and like cover whatever the hell he's trying to do. Something that Peach does a lot is he'll jump, throw a turnip, and then the turnip will force him into shield. And the way to get out of that is one, don't just back up because like that's kind of where he's aiming, he's kind of like aiming behind you. Like, you can actually like attack him as he jumps into the turnip, and he can't really do much because he's stuck in the lag of throwing the turnip, but it's also like really, really quick. As like specifically Falco, you can just like jump there like as soon as he goes for like the turnip throw. It's kind of dangerous though, and but yeah, you have to like very much predict it, but Reese isn't a person that's the, like the least predictable person. See there, I, I don't really recommend shielding the bear as he came down. You can easily just bear down smash, although he did get a short grab that one time. At the same time, it isn't perfect, maybe it's something you want to go for in turn. It's like, you know, you, you, you can kind of test the opponent's uh, tech skill, saying like, I'm, I'm, I'm going to challenge your ability to do this, rather than like, you know, I don't think it's something you want to make into a, a habit necessarily, but like, it worked out for me this time, so I can't really say it's bad. Gang without a shine or doing like a high dare is not good against a peach at low percent. Because even though it does meteor them, sorry, spike them into the ground, uh, you kind of just like. There's not enough lag to really like fuck them up. Hmm. Something I'm seeing a lot of is, uh. See, Sandman's trying to camp a bit more, which is good. Reach is still kind of different. Oh, what up? Okay, uh, 
play against 119 here. Kyle? Kyle! Play him. Sometimes helps him, sometimes hurts him. That's fine. He'll do like down smashes in positions where he should have probably done a different option. Like it still like nets him like a down smash, but maybe it'll send him to the opposite ledge, and then they'll just like get back on stage. Whereas it could have maybe done something else. That was a really risky fair, and I'm glad he didn't like die from it. At the same time, like <laughs> probably maybe should have. It was, it was kind of calling out uh, Peach's forward drift. Probably something that Sandman's catching on to is that Peach moves. Sorry, Reese loves to move forward, like all the time. It's something that he just kind of does with Peach. Okay. Seem to adapt a little bit better than this. It's a good thing that uh, Reese yeah, didn't just say let's go to Battlefield, because this stage actually kind of sucked for. Uh, So I can write stuff down. Because I need to do cool stuff. Come on. Where are you now? Where will will? Okay. Against you. Hex. I'm actually gonna get off of commentary now because, you know, I gotta do shit. I don't wanna stay for this. Fuck me. Okay, thank you. Alright. Oh, thank you. What? Thank you. Yes. time killing at the same time. I did better with a higher top one. Yeah.